short last journey for the Curl of FPSO. Will now be safely set down on the key and uh, for further dismantling and recycling. FPSO was a, a offshore production uh, vessel that uh, operated in the North Sea for over 20 years. After uh, over two years of preparations, engineering and planning, we are finally ready to bring in Curlew FPSO to its final resting place. For this operation we have used a total of four tugs and two line vessels to initially unmoor Curlew and uh, towing it out into the float over position and uh, positioning it above the heavy lift vessel before the lift. The special thing about this project is the size of everything. We have the Coast Coast XGH, which is the second largest heavy transport vessel in the world. And the operation we're doing now, the load-in, is a record-breaking. Um, it has never been used that many SPMT axles at one time. It's 748 axles transporting this uh, 20,000 tons uh, ship, the Curlew, onshore. Um, the combination of all axles is also record-breaking, so uh, yeah, it's really great to, to be a part of this. One of the most critical parts of the operation is that the vessel deflects when you both lift it and when we drive it. So we've had to take that into consideration by using shimming to make sure that we're able to account for this movement. Now as the vessel is uh, safe placed uh, ashore uh, on our production uh, plate, uh, we will now start uh, removing uh, uh, has faced uh, things that has to go um, away from the circle and both out of the circle. Uh, we also have to clean the cargo oil tanks uh, and uh, we will make it ready for machine demolition. On a project like this we can reuse or recycle more than 95% of the materials. The operation is a real achievement for the team at VATS, a real success, a real milestone. Uh, a great collaboration from everybody involved.